Whoa, my microphone isn't even facing me. Let's just hold on, guys. This is the worst intro ever. Yo, what's good, YouTube? My name is Anarchy, and I like to entertain people with my voice. That's right, I'm a professional voice entertainer. So sit back, relax, and chill the F out. And I'd like to welcome you guys to my channel. I told you guys I'm going to try my best to welcome everybody that subscribes to me. And if you're new, old, or or anything on my channel, welcome. I hope you enjoy your stay, and I hope you're enjoying your stay. Right now, you're watching uh, the gameplay I told you about the other day. I went on a 30 kill streak in the Abrams tank on Grand Bazaar, and uh, it was pretty beast. You know, I really enjoyed it. Right here, I take out a Mav with rubble. You don't see that every day, do you? No, you don't. So. I do apologize uh, for yesterday. I didn't release a video. Uh, it got to about two o'clock in the morning when I finished um, rendering this video out into the point where I can record over it. Because what I do before I, uh, I record my commentary is I cut the video down to about 11 to 15 minutes. So that way I'm not sitting here talking for 25 minutes and you guys don't get really bored and, and stuff like that. So. And you see me get a lot of rubble kills in this gameplay. Um, I love my rubble. I love my tank. I've actually switched up my tank now for ra radioactive armor and um, something else. Uh, infrared smoke. But, you know, I dabble. I switch it every now and then to other things, uh, see which I feel more comfortable with. I feel this is the easiest setup, mainly because you have the infrared um, vision. So you can see everybody, anybody that's trying to hide in cracks and stuff. I must say, it is the more newbie your way. Uh, a lot of people say that's newbie. I completely agree with you, it's quite newbie. But, you know what, I got a 30 kill streak. And I got a 32 kill streak on Terran Highway. I hope you guys are looking forward to that. I think I might make this into a series where I just destroy the game with the tank. And me and my mate, uh, I don't want to say who he is yet, but we have some stuff in the works. Uh, it's kind of hard to get get in contact with each other and stuff because he's in Australia, I'm from the United Kingdom and we play in the United States servers so every time you see a gameplay with me and uh, a person called Dunham or a person called Temben, Ten, Tembenopo, I don't know. dude seriously get a better name, <laughs> I'm joking but whenever you see me in a server with them two people or even one of them or the other I'm more than likely playing in a US server so sometimes you might see a little bit of lag. I do apologize for that. Um, just for, no, I just kind of reminded myself about it. And the canister shell. You can't forget the canister, uh, canister shell. That thing is, that thing's a tank in its own, in its own way. And I get myself trapped over here. I thought it was a pretty cool place to go uh, because I wasn't going to get bombarded by people. And I thought, you know, what, I'm going to go over here, help my team, fuck things up. And I thought I could just drive straight over this, but. I was wrong and I was like, oh god, I'm screwed. But I get out, you know, I continue my kill streak. And and yes, yeah, so that's that. So did you guys have a good week? Um, it's it's Saturday today. I had a pretty good week. I went to my interview. Would you like to know how it went? It went brilliant. You know, the interview went I well, okay. I thought the interview went brilliant. And I've touched about this in a video that's not released yet, so I think I might as well just touch on it now because um, that's right, I've been recording for a new series. <clears throat> One sec, I'm gonna have a uh, Sip of my water. <clears throat> so, <clears throat> God, you know, what? I'm fine throughout the entire day, and then as soon as I start talking to you guys, it's as if there's something in my throat. Anyway, so I've started recording a new series, A to Z. Uh, that's what I've called it. The full name of it's going to be called From A to Z with Anarchy. Uh, you guys already know what it is. I'm playing through every single game that I have. Uh, the first episode is on Afro Samurai, and I went for a straight half an hour, non-stop talking to you guys. So I hope you enjoy it. You know, I'm only going to release like one or two episodes. See how they do. If they do all right, or if they if they do half as decent, because I know my Call of Duty video it didn't do very well on my channel. So you know what that means to me? I'm not going to release that much Call of Duty. I'll release a bit of it, but I'm not going to release that much Call of Duty because it doesn't get any recognition on my channel. My main priority is Battlefield 3 now and I would try to do Black Ops 2 if I enjoy Black Ops 2 that is. If I don't enjoy it then I'm not going to play it. I'm not going to play a game that I don't enjoy. And this is a reason why I wanted to do my A to Z. I have a lot of games, a ton of games. I was going to buy Syndicate the other day speaking about that but I didn't. I'm poor. But I have a ton of games and 
they've never been touched by me they're just gathering dust and I was like ah you know what? we're gonna start up a series and we're going to play every single one of these guys and you guys are gonna enjoy it I'm gonna enjoy it we're gonna have a nice bromance on YouTube going a YouTube mance a you mance yo mance I don't know but I was actually talking about my interview I thought it went pretty well I was the only person there there was four of us there was me and three other dudes and I was the only person there, um, apart from this one other dude, that actually looked the part. You know, I wore a suit, I wore my tie. Other people, they were wearing track, not tracky bottoms, jeans and a polo shirt and trainers. And we don't wear that to an interview, no matter what kind of interview it is. And for some reason, right, I heard back yesterday, I didn't get the job. And this is the part that baffles me, okay? This is the part where I think to myself, WTF Batman because apparently I didn't answer a question correctly when they said um, I'm actually going to tell you what the job was for it's for car phone warehouse if you don't know what car phone warehouse is it's a, it's a shop that sells phones and one of his questions to me was have you have you researched what how our deals are or something along those lines this is what his question was meant to be um, but this guy he, uh, he has a really bad star I'm not, I'm not being mean or anything he had a star and it took him a while to get a sentence out, so maybe I misinterpreted his sentence. But I didn't hear these words come out of his mouth. What deals do we have on a car phone warehouse? I never heard this. And I didn't get the job because I didn't research what deals were on a car phone warehouse. Now, two things sparked my mind here. Number one, I had an hour's notice of this interview. You know, I got wrong an hour before the interview. And... I had no time to prepare for it. I had no time to go onto the car phone warehouse website and, and just check everything. I, I literally had a straight, I had to get up, shower, put my suit on, do my hair, uh, brush my teeth before all of that, obviously. And second thing that sparked my mind is he never asked me this question. So I was a little bit confused with this. I was a little bit let down. Uh, couldn't, couldn't have done anything different. I thought I was brilliant in the interview. Uh, as you guys know me, I'm very confident. I'm not afraid to speak. And that's, if anyone ever wants hints and tips on, and this has actually just brought up another topic in my mind, I just wing these things and just bring up my own topics during a video. But I completely, oh, do you know what? I forgot what I've said the original time. Something to do with, um, I can't remember. Anyways, as I mentioned, I just brought my own topic up. How did you guys like quick tips? It's a new series that I'm starting. Somebody wanted me to do a quick tip on recoil and you will get this. I will do a quick tip video on recoil. Uh, I've found a really good effective way to practice recoil and actually I can quite uh, manage my recoil. I might not look like it in a lot of my episodes. Sometimes I just, I get to in the moment and I just shoot, you know. I just shoot randomly and just spray from the hip or spray uh, aiming down sight and just mess up my own aim. But you know, I, I'm i pretty good with recoil. I have a pretty good accuracy. I've got, okay, this is the thing that I say, you never check what someone's accuracy is on battle log. For the main purpose, that suppression makes a big role in this game. I wish that suppression uh, went towards your accuracy bonus. Uh, maybe even if, uh, if it's a half, a percent of accuracy to what a full percent would be with a bullet because I suppress people on purpose you know if I know somebody is around the corner I will suppress that corner and this takes your accuracy down I don't know if you knew this or not uh, I hope you did know this otherwise if you didn't then please stop playing shooting games <laughs> I'm kidding but no I don't reckon you should ever look at somebody's um, accuracy on a, on a battle log my accuracy is on about uh, an average 15 and right here I'm gonna get some more rubble kills I love me some rubble, but no, never look at accuracy. Mine's 15, actually I've got my battle log up at the moment. Mine is, okay, let me read you out my stats. I have a 1,283 score per minute. Uh, this is slowly declining. The reason why this is declining is because I spend uh, a good couple straight days on close quarters. I might not have posted that many gameplays of it because um, most of the games weren't that exciting and stuff like that, but my uh, my score per minute is one two eight three. Uh, last week it was one thousand five hundred or one thousand six hundred, so it's slowly declining. My win loss ratio is ten point thirty nine. Uh, this is going up, but every now and then I join a lobby that ends as I join it, so it goes down uh, because I lose. Accuracy is fourteen point five percent, which is, in my eyes, 
is a good accuracy. I mean, if you have uh, between a 10 and a 20 accuracy, then you're doing your job good. If you have a 90% accuracy, then I'm gonna say that you're hacking, I'm sorry. <laughs> Unless you've ever played one game and you shot two bullets. Actually no, you shot one bullet through three people and missed one bullet or something like that, I don't know. And my KD ratio is 2.85. Now, I want to make this thing clear to you guys to ever see my my stats on my battle log. If you're not a friend of my battle log, feel free to add me. But when I bought premium, I reset my stats. I know a lot of people said that you shouldn't reset your stats because it gives you false pretense or something like this. I wanted to reset it to compare me to my old self. I used to I used to be one of those guys that used to snipe, you know. I'm not going to I'm not going to uh, sugarcoat it. I used to camp with a sniper. I used to be good at it, you know. I'd always be first. I'd always help my team out. I'd sit at the back of the map, or maybe not even the back of the map, with my bipod, my eight times zoom, and I'd get about 25 kills in a single game of rush, with a score of about 20,000. Because that's how good I was. I used to get always headshot stuff like that. I was always good at aiming the sniper scope, but then I picked up the aggressive style in Battlefield, and then I just became this beast that you see today. So I hope you guys have enjoyed. I believe that was a 30 kill streak in a tank. If I'm wrong, uh, I do apologize, but I'm pretty sure that was the right gameplay. And I do apologize that I haven't posted up the Skyrail gameplay yet. Like I said yesterday, I was really busy and I was really tired. And this was the easiest gameplay that I saw that I could convert over into a MP4 format and just cut it down. Because all I had to cut down is at the beginning of two minutes where I get a couple kills with the uh, Skyrail. So expect the Skyrail gameplay either tomorrow or the day after. And if you want to see me do a series on tanks, maybe giving you tips or hints, let me know. And here's, uh, actually I was going to ask you a question, but I don't have one today. I'm going to let you guys slide today. I'm not going to make you do any homework. I hope you enjoyed the video, guys. Actually, here's a question. If you had premium or if you have premium, did you or will you or would you reset your stats to see how you are now compared to your old self? That's what, that's what I think is a good question. Catch you guys later. My name is Anarchy. Stay sexy. Peace.